I'm Dominic Stevens. Wall Street share prices have plunged over the past month and I see the New Zealand media has really picked up on that, perhaps because scary economic news gets people to click on the articles. People might be surprised therefore to learn that I view this as having very limited implications for the New Zealand economy. We're putting together our new economic forecasts at the moment and for example I think a 7% drop during October for US share prices will have very little influence on my view of what New Zealand GDP will do next year. There is however a bit of a warning that what's going on in the United States at the moment could happen to New Zealand in a few years time. In the US, a very, very strong economy has led to rising inflation and therefore higher interest rates. When interest rates rise, investors tend to think, well, I'll put my money into bonds rather than equities, and consequently equity prices tend to fall away despite a strong economy. This is the reason that interest rates and asset prices tend to be inversely correlated. Now in New Zealand, the parallel situation is more around house and farm prices. They've been bid much higher in recent years due to low interest rates. If interest rates rose at some point in New Zealand's future, we may well see house prices and farm prices fall. And that would have a much more serious direct effect on the economy. Not only because people have a lot of their wealth tied up in houses and farms, but also because New Zealand's banking system is largely secured over lending to houses and farms, if banks found that their security dropped away, they may become less keen to lend into the productive parts of the economy. So certainly drop in house prices would affect the New Zealand economy directly, but the question is when might that happen? Actually our answer to that is well not in the immediate future, actually New Zealand's just experienced a big drop in fixed mortgage rates. That in the short term is actually likely to see the housing market pick up a bit. Talk to you next week.